It is a big day for Pittsburgh Public Schools. For the first time in more than a year, all students who want to be back in the classroom will have that opportunity. This as the final category of students returned this morning and the district is still struggling to get some of them a ride to class. This is something we've been closely following and we want to bring Chris Hoffman back in with us from Brookline on the return of 13,000 students. Chris. Heather and David, about 8,000 students are staying remote, but you touched base on it there. Due to that bus driver shortage, there are still students with no ride to physically get to school. Now, that number has significantly changed. At one point, Pittsburgh Public did not have enough seats for about 2,600 students. Now, it will be 638 students in need of a ride. Students that fall into that group should have been notified from the district through a robo call, and students who have rides should have gotten a mailer. Now, starting next week, the district will partner with the Pittsburgh Transportation Group to reduce that seat gap. They will offer up about three additional buses. The district tried reaching out to other groups as well, including some of the local colleges. But that seat gap will not reach zero. The district expects it to be about 400 students still in need of a ride next week. If anything changes, we'll let you know on air and online. Live in Brookline, Chris Hoffman, KDKA News.